Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today in Dorf Romantique. This is an interesting little city builder, and I have been enjoying it so far. It's based off a hexagonal system, and our goal is to build a city, but not a traditional way. We, have, we start with these 40 tiles, and each tile could have multiple or one element on it, like so you can see our first tile here has a lot of fields on it. So we'll just go ahead and plop that down. And we, we build our city based off that. And as you can see, as you plop more tiles down, you get other areas you can connect to. So we can go ahead and build another field tile there. And, and there you go. We already got 210 points because we have connected those two fields. Now this tile has some trees on it and a little empty land. So let's go ahead and build that like that. And ooh, now we got a windmill that wants us to attach it to several fields. So there's already one, two, three, four, five, six fields on it. It wants us to do seven, so we'll put that there, and we only want to connect it to one more. Now, if we do that, it might, well, it's telling us it's green, so let's see if it likes that or not. All right, fantastic, so that took that, and this wants us to connect it to two more tiles. As you can see, the number of tiles increases as we complete more quests. So obviously, it's very important to complete as many quests as you can so you can keep expanding your little city. And there, that goes right there. And we completed that by connecting it to more fields. And man, we're just building massive fields over here. Let's go ahead and do that and get that field in there. Here we go, now we got a tile with some trees and some fields. So let's spin this a little bit so the trees connect because that's it wants us to get to 14 forests. So we can go ahead and build that there. And now we have a tile with field and train track. All right, so we can drop that there. Now these squares we cannot build on anymore because uh, they, they require, they must have train tracks on them. Now we got this river tile here as well and it has field a part of it. So we can go ahead and let's spin that like that. And there we go. That river tile is also connected to the field and it has some trees we can connect to. So let's go ahead and connect those there. Uh, looks like we got a little bit of uh, homes next to the river. Drop those there. And let's go ahead and have that curve out like that. So there, our river starting to form. Can get some more trees going. And will that be able to connect? No, we'll need to um, have a river with tree tile there. But we can put these trees over here and connect them there. Great. And now let's go ahead and build some more fields over here. And another tree tile can go right there. Great, and we gain some more tiles, that's fantastic. Um, let's, can we rotate this? And those won't connect like that. And if we rotate there, we can connect those two homes. And we got some points and that train tile is now connected. Uh, let's see, what do we got here? Another river with trees. So this is kind of what we want. Um, there we go. We can connect those like that. Fantastic. So we got the bonus for connecting the river tiles. And this wants two more river tiles to keep the quest going. Let's go ahead and have it spin out that way. Fantastic. And another windmill to connect, but it doesn't want all those fields. So let's go ahead and plop this windmill. Um, yeah, we can place it right there. Start connecting it there. And this has some trees on it as well. I like this game so far. Down in the comments below, let me know what you think of Dorf Romantique. It's an interesting city builder, I'll give it that. Uh, I enjoy the a little bit of strategy going into it. And let's go ahead and build another set of train tracks there. It's certainly not like SimCity or anything like that. You can't just delete, or there might be a way to delete, and I just haven't figured that out yet, and start all over and you only have a limited number of tiles to keep building with. All right, so we've got more fields to connect. So let's go ahead and put these fields right, um, yeah, I guess right there. And this one's eight connected to it, but it also has some city tiles. So let's go ahead and, no, we don't wanna do that. This wants to connect to eight and eight only. Um, so if we do, this, there we go. Oh, and this one's a, another large field, so we can put that there. And another tile, ooh, okay, oh, we can't go there, why not? Because it turns, I see. Um, 
Yeah, we can have our train track turn here. I think that's pretty good. So we'll go ahead and put that there. A river tile, and I want that to curve that way. And we have a tile with some home and field on it. So if we rotate this, I think this will... No, we don't want to necessarily do that because I think that might close certain things off. Um, so let's just go ahead and place this one over here and connect it to that chain. There we go. Now we have another tile with homes and fields. So if we do that, that'll connect both the homes and the fields. That's fantastic. There we go. And we're at what? 1,230 points. Oh, this little city is coming along. I love the graphics, guys. This is fantastic. Again, down in the comments below, let me know what you think of Dorf Romantique. Um, I've only been playing it, let's see what Steam tells me, for 15 minutes so far, and it has uh, blown my mind away. And it's pretty cheap on Steam. I think I picked it up for like 10 bucks, 12 bucks. So certainly go check it out. I think you'll enjoy it. And it's not anything too crazy if you just want to come home after work or come home after school and fiddle around with it for 10 or 15 minutes and then go do something else. I think this is the perfect little relaxing game for anyone. All right. Ooh, so if we do that, we will complete both those quests. So let's go ahead and do that. And we have another tile to turn. And yeah, let's go ahead and turn the track like that. And we completed that quest too. We got 68 tiles still. We are chugging right along. And if we put this tile here, that will complete another quest. We're just knocking out quests. 72 tiles to keep building with. Let's go ahead and um, do we want to connect the forest or the house? Let's go ahead and connect the house because either way it's going to close off one of them. So let's spin that there and we'll get that house connected there. Fantastic. And I think if we rotate this tile, we can get, uh, we can only get one of each of the fields connected. Um... What do we want to do? Let's go ahead and connect this field like that. There we go. And another big forest tile. Let's let's come over here. And I would like to connect that all there. Fantastic. Another quest completed. So this one's 98 trees. And if we build like this, that'll connect that. Fantastic. And some home and field. We connect it there. We could let's come down here and connect those two homes. Beautiful. Another river tile with some trees and field. So we can let's do that. 76 tiles. We are just chugging right along here, guys. And let's add this field there. Perfect. And then we will close like that. Why won't it let me build there? I wonder if because it doesn't want too many fields around it. I'm not quite sure. Oh, that and it's a train track. Um, yeah, that looks pretty good. There we go. Perfect. 60. What are we at? 2,200 points. And we can go ahead and connect our tree, little forest, right? Um, yeah, let's go ahead and connect that forest like that. Ooh, is this an ocean tile? Oh, so we could have it spill out into the ocean right there. Okay, I like how it's creating a little bit of coastline there. There we go. A little ocean or lake starting to form on this beautiful little city. And we will have this, um, I guess, turn like that. And then another river tile. Now, could we have it come off? We can't. Ooh, and there's train tracks on there. So we got quite a lot to do with this tile. Um... Is that, oh, it's end of the line train tracks. So if we put this here, then we'd have to do two river tiles there. Yeah, there, it's the end of the train track there because they're picking the weed up at the field. Ah, I like that little idea. All right, and now we've got some homes and rivers. And I want to spin this a different, can I spin this? All right, I guess it'll have to spin that way. That's okay. And then come back over here with the train tracks. And that'll start to turn out like that. And we'll put some homes in here and get those connected there. And let's go, I wanna to start to build a city. Um, so let's rotate this back around and those are all gonna connect now. 
and if we build that like that and those two train tracks um uh can we rotate that yeah let's rotate that so that starts to turn back out and it doesn't like that because it only wants to be connected to six so i think we'll have to start another train station over here so little city do you want here's your first depot the start of your brand new train tracks and we can go ahead and put that there perfect another perfect 60 and we will put in a river right here and let's go ahead and connect that field like that another little train track yeah we want that to start to turn away from the city a tree tile and that'll close all that, but it will connect all of those, and that is exactly what we want. All right, a river tile with some fields, which will do very well right there. And then we'll go ahead and have this river start to turn away. And it can, there we go, like that. All right, a nice housing tile that wants to connect to 29 homes. So if we do that, Perfect and man, we are just racking up all these perfects guys. This this is nice and peaceful. Okay, that's too much So if we go ahead and connect that there and then let's go ahead and uh, Let's go ahead and rotate our screen a little bit And spin this tile. I don't know if we can squeeze that house and tree in. I don't think we can Let's go ahead and connect that right there now we just got a house on an empty tile. That's okay. Let's um, let's put it right there. And then, oh, perfect. Look at that. I just like that. Ah, oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. If you guys have been enjoying this, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all this great content on time and in an orderly fashion. I think I'm going to keep playing this uh, game, make a couple little episodes of it. There's certainly a lot to explore. We're almost to Landscaper 1. Uh, we need what 11 more tiles uh, Engineering 2 we need to form a train route with 15 tracks and Ocean 1 form a body of water with 20 segments of water So I think let's just go ahead and finish these out um, All right, so we can drop this field tile here Yeah, we'll drop that there and Let's see we've got another section of train track and we'll go ahead and do, do, do. this needs quite a bit so we'll drop that there and then we got a house with some fields around it so that can connect there a nice river tile there house with more fields and some trees um let's do yeah let's go ahead and do oh that won't connect that's okay let's go ahead and build it over over here Connect those trees together. Nice, perfect 60. And we got a railroad and river tile to place. So if we, yeah, we can do, can I rotate it? Uh, let's do that. Perfect. And another field tile to place. And let's go ahead and rotate that so those all connect. Another river tile with some homes on it. Um... Yeah, that looks good. Have the the home river that river pour into the pour into the lake there that we're starting to form. Um, uh, where are we gonna put this tile at, guys? Uh, can I rotate it? I can't rotate it, but it would complete that quest. Hmm. Mm, what about here? Yeah, let's go ahead and place it there. All right. So now a field tile with some trees and if we rotate all that that connects perfect 60 there again we're just killing it guys um and let's go ahead and put this can i connect to any of these trees i cannot hum let's let's connect i think we can connect here though there we go and what do we unlock the biome unlocked lavender and of course we're going to claim that oh fantastic that must have been from landscaper one all right so we still need to get five more train tracks connected together to get engineer one and three more river tiles connected to get ocean one so we are just zooming right along um how about we put this over here i like that and another river tile to connect 
everything to. And we'll connect that. And we've got a field tile with a house on it. And we will put that there. Another river tile. Um, let's go ahead and put that river tile there. And we've got a large tile with homes. And put that there. There we go. And, ooh, we got a um, train track that's kind of split. Um, let's do, let's do that so we can kind of start to wrap around this way with our train track. All right, and then we can connect these homes there. So they want six more home tiles there. And then let's put this, because it wants us to close this off, right? But we're going to have to close it off with a river tile here eventually. And connect those like that. Another nice tile with a bunch of homes on it. And... Yeah, we'll do it like that. Perfect. So we got some trees and a forest tile. And let's put those right. Uh, we can't connect those trees. That's okay. We'll connect that like that. Perfect. And come back over here. And we will connect those forest tiles. And some field and homes. Let's connect like that. And then we'll put, I don't want to build too much over there because that's kind of where our um, our lake is going to be, guys. Uh, those can connect like that. And this one's 18 connected to it. So we'll go ahead and drop that. Oop, there comes our river tile we're going to use to block that here. So let's not forget to do that here in a second. And this can go there. And our river tile to go ahead and close this off and complete that quest. Fantastic. And another tile with homes and a little bit of field. Uh, okay, so if we do that, we're actually going to close off the trees, but we would complete the homes. So we're not going to do that. And we're going to come over here, and I guess we're going to start forming another city. That's all right. Uh, all right, so little home, little tree. Let's see if we can make this work in our favor. Um, it closes that. Uh, bu -bu -bum. All right, so that's not going to go there. That's okay. And it can go here, though. There we go. Some trees and the houses connect. Another river tile. Uh, we need to connect, what, one more? Yeah, let's go ahead and connect one more so we can complete the river tile quest. And we'll go ahead and, well because that would just make it a big old loop. So let's go ahead and put that there. And we've now got a field and tree tile. And we will put that here. No, let's put that here. There we go. And this can go there. Again, comment on down below. Um, I'm gonna play this for a little bit. We're finishing up my little blacksmith shop. The other two games I have on deck, and I want your guys' opinion, is uh, The Final Station, or I can also go ahead and start playing something else. I know Subnautica has been thrown quite a bit, and I do want to play that, don't get me wrong, but I'm waiting for that to go on sale, because uh, $30 is a little pricey for me right now. So let's go ahead and put that tile there. So just let me know what your guys' ideas are. I've got quite a few games. Um, let me just scroll through my Steam library really quick. Like I've got Dawn of Man, Door Kickers, Cliff Empires, Company of Heroes, Bioshock, Big Pharma, Crusader Kings, uh, Crisis. I could try and play. It might be a little hard recording with my computer. Ooh, we need to get out to this tile here soon too. All right, so we've got another home tile or housing tiles, we'll put that there. And then let's go ahead and just so we reach that tile, let's see. Okay, it wants us to attach 18 fields to it. We can certainly do that. We can go ahead and put this river tile here and that completed the river tile and we unlocked the boat. All right, so let's go ahead and claim the boat. So now we just need to connect four more train tracks to finish the engineer. Go ahead and put that river tile there. Oh, there we go. We're going to make ourselves a little horseshoe, uh, even though we might have just blocked it out. That's all right. Let's see. Let's go ahead and start connecting some of these fields together. And can we spin that like that? Perfect. So that can start like that. Another ocean tile. Let's 
let's go ahead and drop that right there. And then we got a end of line train track. So we can, um, cause this is heading towards the ocean. Let's go ahead and have that be the end of the line. And we can't spin it though, that's sad. All right, so let's go ahead and put that there. And we completed that back up to 48 tiles and a lot of fields. And we're gonna need a lot of fields here to complete this quest. So we'll drop that field tile there. And let's go ahead and drop this here. There we go. And we've got a, what do we got? House and trees. All right, so this wants two more homes. But if we do that, we're gonna block the trees off, so we can't quite use that. Uh, let's go ahead and put this, do, do, do. Spin that around right there, perfect. And we got our boat tile. Oh, that definitely needs to be used. And how about, uh, how about right? Why is it not letting us do that? Is it, oh, because it only wants to be connected to eight. All right, what about our little river over here? Yeah, there we go. Little boat tile there, perfect. This wants to be connected to 26 river tiles. Put that there. And we'll come over here with more field tiles. Spin that around. And we'll do it like that. And then... Um, let's go ahead and put a field tile here. So this needs nine more and this needs 10 more to connect to. We can put some homes there and then connect that like that. And we'll build our train track like that. Keep that chugging along. Ooh, this is an interesting junction. Some homes and another three-way connector. Yeah, that looks good there. Got some trees we need to connect, but that'll close that out. So we can go ahead and tuck our trees right there. Another straight section of train track. Let's put that, let's put that there. Cause we now need what? Two more tiles of train track connected. Let's go ahead and rotate that like that. Perfect. All right, let's see what we can do over here. That's gonna close both those out. So definitely don't wanna do that. That looks good there. Another home tile. And we will put that like that. Train track with field. Looks good there. And we got our engineer tile. We claimed the locomotive. How nice. So that is the end of the first mission. That was pretty fun. I like it. Again, don't forget to like the video if you don't mind or if you've been enjoying Dorf Romantique. Comment on down below what you think of the game. I have loved it so far, enjoying the graphics. Look at this beautiful little city, town, area, whatever you want to call it that we have crafted. If you don't mind, also please subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all this great content on time and in an orderly fashion. Thank you so much for stopping by today, guys, and we'll see you in the next, ne the next Dorf Romantique video.